Hey everybody, welcome back to Styrene Relics. Uh, man, this weekend was Detroit Auto Modelers show, and I didn't get a chance to go. Uh, I guess I could have went, but I wasn't feeling up to it. I don't think I should have went down, and so I stayed home. I had full intentions on going, but I... Uh, I guess you could say I chickened out at the last minute. Uh, between the ride down there and walking around all day, I was afraid I was just going to be toast by the time it was over with. So I stayed home. Um, usually ride down with Phil over at Horton's Hot Rod Shop. And uh, we have a lot of fun going down there. And uh, come back with fat bags and thin wallets. Seems like every time we go down there. But um, he asked me if uh, if there was anything I was after. And I told him there was, if he didn't mind picking them up. And uh, so he did. So let me show you my stash ads that my buddy got for me. Right off the bat, let's take care of the little stuff. He got me some distributors. Three distributors and one magneto. Can't ever have enough of these. Uh, five bucks for a distributor is pretty cheap nowadays. So I like it. Um, yeah, they're, it's it's, uh, it's a good good deal. I've used those uh, a couple of times. Um, I've used... Oh, that's not it. I thought I had one right here, but I guess I don't. Anyways, uh, yeah, th those are nice distributors. I, I kind of like using those. Uh, I asked him if he got down there and he saw uh, the, the 60 Ford pickups with the trailers. I, I want that one especially. And then this one would have been my second choice. Uh, the trailer one, he said there wasn't any out there. Uh, it just wasn't meant to be, so... Nobody had them. The whole place where nobody had any. So at least he didn't see any. So I grabbed this one. This one I believe is 63. Uh, first thing I did was crack it open. Take a look at it. Um, this one's the long box unibody. My grandpa had the short box 63 uh, pickup. And uh, so this one's kind of special for me. Um really kind of anxious to get started on this not exactly sure what i'll end up doing with it um it may be a shop truck or a, a mild custom type of deal um uh, i'm not I'm, i just haven't decided just yet but it's going to be one of the two i i'm sure of that so nice clean body i mean the 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 Mold feels good. I don't see too much flash. Uh, well, I don't see any flash to be truthful. So, and the other parts in the bag just uh, look really crisp and really cool. So, digging that. Thanks, Phil, for picking that up for me. Uh, the other thing he got me was the uh, 30 Ford 5 window. Um, I'm a 5 window kind of guy. Um, and I've never had this kit. <laughs> so... I am really, really happy to get it. Uh, I've watched on a bunch of YouTube channels on these particular kits, and everybody can't say enough about them. Um, old Tom Rambler, Tom, he's got a couple of them he's done, and man, do I like them. I mean, super cool stuff, guys. So... That's it for my stash ads. Uh, it was uh, short and sweet. I did tell Phil if he got down there and he saw a moon mixer box, I'd buy it off him. But, you know, I guess he didn't find any of those. So, anyways, I did run across this from my buddy Rick Zink. He sent me this uh, as I get well soon. Uh, I got to looking at it. I'm thinking, man, I love this thing. This is so cool. Um, the only thing I don't like about this kit is the fuel ejection. 
uh, system on it. I just never have cared for those. So I think I'm going to put a six pack on it and I may run it uh, without any side fenders or side uh, hoods on it and just maybe the top hood. I'm not sure just yet, but going to keep it pretty much box stock. Uh, I just like that look. I kind of did get started on it a little bit. Uh, man, it was real clean as well. There wasn't a whole lot of flash. A couple little mold lines right in here. And I had a little bit of flash on the driver's window up in the top. But that was it. I mean, it, not much at all. So I cleaned it up, primed it, shot a little bit of um, light brown on it. Um, I think... Uh, I may do some more work today. I'm kind of feeling pretty good. This is two days in a row now, so real happy with that. Might put some color on it. I'm not sure. My first color is uh, I'd like to get a dark green, um, but my dark green is almost a black, and it's not what I'm after. Uh, my second choice is a burgundy, so we'll see uh, how I end up going with it, but it'll be full fendered. Mostly because I just don't have any fendered hot rods. Not many. And uh, this one looks so good with the fenders. So, yep, we're going to see if I can get that one put together. Uh, let's see, what else we got going? That's all done. Shop cards. Uh, anybody out there that needs a shop card for me? I'll leave my uh, email address in my description. Uh, you guys give me a holler, give me a shout uh, with the email. I'll be more than happy to send you one of these. Um, it's not a big deal. I got a bunch of them. So uh, let me know. I'll do that. Uh, give me a like and subscribe. And uh, we will go from there. Guys, I appreciate you stopping by. Take care of yourselves. Uh, let's remember that, uh, you know, you only get so many trips around the sun. And let's not forget that uh, who put us here. Okay, guys. We'll talk to you later. Bye.